Hey guys, it's Alan. Um, I just want to talk a little bit about the wasted vote belief. Um, I just want to say that uh, I'm in full support of Dennis Kucinich. Uh, he's my man, and uh, I have a little crush on him too. Well, anyway, um, basically, I've been campaigning for him for a little while now, and I've been talking to a lot of Clinton and Obama supporters. Anyway, um, as I discuss politics with these individuals, I, you know, I, I saw them where Dennis stands and where his issues are. And for the most part, these people who support Barack or Clinton, they say they like him. They agree with Dennis on where he stands. Right? I'm like, yeah, yeah. And we're, me and this individual are seeing eye to eye, right? And I'm like, oh, okay, great. They're now going to support a second tier candidate. Yes, yes. I got another one for Dennis. But then, dun, dun, dun. They say these words that trouble me so deeply. They say, Dennis. He's a great man, and I support him a lot. Um, I agree with him, but the truth is that he's unelectable. And it's just too unrealistic to think that he'll ever win. This really irks me. How can you say this? How can you say you're wasting a vote for somebody you want? Somebody you, who you agree with? Where's the logic in that? Tell me, please. Because uh, I really don't see any in it. What really, really troubles me the most about this wasted a vote belief is that we're never going to change this country if we don't stand up for what we truly believe in. Um, that's really it. We're going to go nowhere if we don't fight for what we want. And if you deem people as unelectable, then of course we're never going to progress as a nation. We're not going to see any change. And if we do see change, it's in the direction where you don't want to go. So what I'm asking is that you stand up for what you believe. And it's the only way that we're ever going to change this world. So next time you say it's a wasted vote. Well, it might not be if it's what you truly want.